Now, when we last left off in our life, Johnny Branch had just given his girlfriend, C. Iverson, a promise ring. Promised that he wouldn't cheat, he would do her right, and she would be that one with him in the NFL, right by his side. But see, it wouldn't last that long. Because that next week, Johnny was selected with three other college football players. Malik Ellis, London Bridges, and Johnny Hillhart to shoot a commercial for ESPN in the Columbus area. They had a crazy conversation. Check out what happened. <laughs> yeah, so man, I've been getting so much ass since I've been in school. Man, I slept with twins my first night on campus. What about you, Bridges? I'm Neil Bridges' brother. What you think? Okay, LB, so you gotta like that. <laughs> Man, all I do is let him touch my hair. After that, it's on and cracking. Shit, me? I ain't slept with no chicks since I've been in college. Yeah, I knew them Ohio State girls was corny as hell. Nah, man, them bras, they get loose, man. But, uh, I mean, I got a girl at home, you know what I'm saying? So I ain't trying to cheat. Oh, so you faithful, huh? Yeah, I'm faithful. But don't think that I can't sleep with any one of these chicks that's going to this school right now. You know, a matter of fact, it's a party tonight if you want to come. Man, watch how these bras be all over me when I walk in there. But I just don't sleep with them because I don't want to. Yo, this party better be jumping. All right, I tell you what. I give you $100 if you can get some ass before this night is over. All right, that's a bet. But will you see me leave out with a chick and go to my car? I'm going to come back with her panties on my rearview mirror. You can bet that. All right, that's a bet. Now see right here, Johnny Branch wasn't using his head. All he wanted to do was to prove to this guy that he could get some ass and that he was the man on campus. But things like this happen. Some people are just easily influenced. Showtime back at y'all another video bringing y'all this NCAA 13 Road to Glory with the wide receiver Johnny Branch. First off, before I get into this commentary, I want to shout out Deal Killer 21 for getting the answer right about uh what beat that was, what band beat that was that I used in the video. As you just heard it, that is uh this is the life by Rick Ross. You know, I kind of made it easy. I said I used this song. You know, in a lot of my videos, and he was the first person to get it right, so he was the first person to get the shout out. You see Johnny Branch up here lining up, sit your five dollar ass down. But y'all see just how dude just pop back up, like, like go back and rewind that if you missed it. But like I blocked the dude, and then dude like just got right back up, like that was weird to me. I just I had to show that because that's like some of the craziest shit I've ever seen in a, in a video game before. When you see Johnny Branch is open. But Braxton Miller is taking off and getting the first down, man. He really should have passed the ball on that one, but he doesn't. As you can see, Ohio State is ranked number one in the nation, and Michigan is ranked number 19. Man, I really hate the, the uh, Michigan Wolverines. As you look at Johnny Branch's stats from the season so far, I mean, he's just been out here beasting 20 touchdowns on the season. Like, that's crazy. We out here trying to break records today. And you see Johnny Branch going across the middle. They try to pull him down, and a second defender comes in and makes him fumble the ball. Makes him fumble, goes to the sideline, 
coach is, is pissed off right now. Like, you know, saying, how the hell could you do that? You know, I mean, he's pissed off. I mean, you know, any coach would be fumbling at the goal line. You know, damn, it's fucked up. So you see Johnny Branch down there right there on the ground. And he's holding his knee. He's holding his knee. I mean, all you got to do, he said, hold up. You're going to be all right. Just go ahead, walk it off. You know, he ain't going to miss no time. He ain't going to miss no time. So we'll score seven to zero still. Second quarter, third and two. And Johnny Brand is going across the middle and getting popped again. I think um, that fumble, you know, maybe affected him a little bit on that play. But he's going to come across the middle one more time, pick up the first down. And we got a penalty on the play. So that was pretty much a free play as uh, that man was off sides. So second and 10, still in the second quarter. And I'm like, uh, what the hell was Braxton doing? Like, he threw that ball way behind Johnny Branch. I mean, damn, he got to get it together. So as the second quarter is winding down, we only got three points on the board. You know, we need to make something happen out here. Braxton is throwing this ball up. And look at this amazing catch by Johnny Branch. Damn, look at Coach. Even Coach is hyped about that one. I bet he forgive him for that fumble that he had earlier, right? <laughs> Man, that was a crazy catch right there like just look at how he go up go up on the one man and then gets tackled by the other guy still holding on to the ball like that is strong as y'all can see I switched up things I got the little visor on Johnny Branch out here first and 10 going up again get another catch in the third quarter the games get a little tighter five receptions 120 yards and a touchdown for Johnny Branch so far trying to make things happen so we can take this lead out here and you know they got the curl route, and y'all know I hate running the curl route, but he burns his man deep, and we get the touchdown, and we're about to take the lead, 17 to 14. Now they got Johnny Branch lining up for the run, breaking one tackle, going in trying to break another, but he doesn't. Picks up eight yards, eight yards on that play, pretty good, pretty good. You know I usually get a tackled in the backfield when they call that play. But I don't go across the middle on this one. And I go up on the sideline, get that catch, and damn, I'm just burning number 18. <laughs> they need to get somebody to cover Johnny Branch because he is just too cold out here for these uh, Michigan boys. Man, I think this catch might have been a little better than the last one, if you ask me. Because, damn, like, he just towered over that guy. Like, he was just, just too tall for him, man, going down that sideline. And then he turning on the Jets, man. Turning on the Jets. They could not catch him. Everybody's congratulating. Like, don't y'all hate that? Like, I just always find that weird. Like, when a football player smacks the other man on the ass, I just just find that to be weird. Oh, damn. I, I missed the sit your file. I last down on that one. But Braxton Miller fumbled the ball on that perfect block that Johnny Branch threw out there, man. Damn. It's messed up. So, on that turnover, they would go down and score the touchdown. So, we're down four points. Going across the middle where Johnny Branch is. Getting the first down. Going into the fourth quarter. Three minutes, 18 seconds left on a third and 21. Can y'all believe this shit? Third and 21, man. Braxton Miller, like, got a couple sacks on that play. He's going to throw it deep to the man on the other side of the field, even though I believe he should have threw it to Johnny Branch, but it doesn't matter. Points are points, and we had a lead up by three. Third and eight, going across the middle. Picking up about 15 on that play. Ooh, school breaker for Johnny Branch. Most receiving yards in a game. In a game. Third and one. Fourth quarter. Trying to see what I got out here. Ain't got nothing. Braxton Miller's going to take off and get the first down. And they going to take me out of the game. And, you know, we going to get the win. Beating Michigan. Beating Michigan. This feels great because, I mean, he could have went there. Could have went there. But thanks for watching. I'm out, y'all. Showtime.
Showtime. Showtime.